Digital SAT Math Flashcards, Sokotoa plus Area. For these questions, we'll solve for a missing side using trigonometry, just like we did in Otocento number 11. Then we'll use area equals one half base times height. Just make sure that you understand that in a right triangle, the base and the height are each of the legs. In other words, the sides that are not the hypotenuse. In this example, we'll first make a picture. We'll label the given information. And we notice we're missing one of the legs, in this case, AB. We're going to need that to find the area, so why don't we label it with an X? Now we can circle the angle of interest, and then label the hypotenuse, the opposite, and the adjacent relevant to that angle. We want to relate opposite and adjacent, so we want to use TOA or tangent. So tangent is opposite over adjacent, so we can write tangent of 65 degrees is equal to x over 18. Multiplying both sides by 18 gives us x is equal to 18 tan of 65 degrees. Now we can put that new side we just found on our picture, and we can use area equals 1 half base times height, where the base is 18 and the height is 18 tan of 65. This gives us 162 tan of 65. Remember the question said that the area is equal to k tan of 65, but we see that the answer is k is equal to 162. Pause this video and take a second to write this question down, which we will solve on the following slides. We'll once again circle the angle of interest. We'll label the hypotenuse opposite and adjacent. And we'll once again use TOA because we want to relate opposite and adjacent. So tangent of 29 degrees is equal to 14 over x. We can swap the tan of 29 and the x to see that x is equal to 14 over tan of 29. We can now add that to our picture and use area equals 1 half base times height once again. And we find that the area is equal to 98 over tan of 29 degrees. We see that resembles choice C, so we can confidently lock in choice C as our answer. Pause this video and see if you can remember this important DSET math concept.